Okay, I've kind of cleaned up my uh, my board here, and we're going to put our finishing touches on these two pieces, which is uh, basically the. I went ahead and put the eyes in, so that I could show you the. This is the red that I put on the flesh afterwards. In other words, to kind of give it a uh, look. You water down the oxide real strong water it down a lot then you just sort of brush it over it and when it dries it gives the skin sort of a look but you don't want it too red you just want it uh, red enough it gives that blushing look to the face, in other words. But make sure that your eyes and everything like that are dry before you do this because you can run the uh, cause them to run. See that? And then when you dip it in the antiquing solution, it, it just really comes alive. There we go. Take a little bit more. This is actually red oxide is what I'm using. You can use most reds. I like the red oxide. I like the way it, it works. On the old man, I'm going to just sort of put it Use, use your uh, use your water at that time, in other words, just sort of bring it down. Okay. Just sort of like a little brush stain is what it is you use. Put it on the gives the face a little lightness, a little color. Not just that dry look, see that? Now I want you to notice these are both three inch characters, but yet they look very different from one another. Now they're both carbons of course, but they're very much different from one another as far as characters are concerned. Put this back over here. Ooh. Just a second. Go ahead. Look at the characters here. Okay, well, now the characters are finished. Now, on my, and I'll show you after it's through, on my uh, scene, I'll have my, um, a little bit more red in that nose there, there we go. Uh, just a little bit on the ears there. I'll have the course we're going to leave him and I will dip him in the antiquing solution and we'll have well let me, let me turn it where you can kind of see it a little bit better we'll have it like this in other words the old man looking at it the and we'll have some wood chips down there to sort of give it the, uh, <coughs> the look that he's been carving okay well, that's the painting for this little scene, and when I get through it, I'll show you how it looks when it's all antiqued and stuff like that. And um, it's been fun painting. Like I said, it's just not my most enjoyable time uh, to paint, but it's a necessity that I have to do. And just use plenty of water. Water down your paints. 
and so it doesn't look like it's looks like it's stained in other words it looks like the painting excuse me the character is not painted but it's sort of a stain type uh, color and then when I put the uh, antiquing solution on it it will uh, darken even more so all right well that's our painting lesson and uh, this is our scene and God bless you now have a good day